everyone, welcome to another episode of Cravings Blog. I'm Karen Ahmed and today we're going to make a red kidney bean hummus. A hummus is a great party pleaser. It's so easy to prepare and you put out a large platter of it and everybody just loves to tuck into it. But today we're making a little healthier version of the regular chickpea hummus. I'm making a red kidney bean hummus. You need a couple of ingredients and you can eat it just like a regular hummus. What I've been doing lately is spreading it on wraps for my children's lunches and I find that I'm giving them a really protein packed lunch. So let's get started. I'm gonna get most of the liquids in here first, starting with the juice of a lemon. The reason for that is I wanna help the, uh, the red kidney beans break down much faster. Now, I have a pretty big blender. In fact, I bought this specifically to make um, hummus. But if you have a smaller blender, don't worry, I've been there too. Um, all you need to do is probably make it in batches. Next, I'm going to add tahini. This is a cup of tahini. This is an absolute must for every hummus. It truly is the most luscious sesame paste you've ever seen. You can find this at any Middle Eastern store. And this gives the hummus something really, really special. I'm going to add a couple of cloves of spiced garlic, about four to five cloves of uh, roasted garlic. You can use roasted garlic or you can use the spiced garlic for my spiced garlic recipe which is on my channel at youtube.com slash cravings blog. Next, I'm going to add a 19 ounce can of red kidney beans. Now I prefer to use canned kidney beans because I find that the kidney beans are already quite mushy. So it works really well. Next, some extra virgin olive oil. Now I'm adding about two tablespoons now and I'll probably add a few tablespoons later. Some pepper and some coarse salt. And I'll add more later after I taste it. So let's give this a whirl. It's a beautiful consistency. What I'm going to do now is add some fresh parsley. I've got about a cup here and I'm going to roughly chop it. Half is going to go into the blend and the other half I'm just going to uh, use almost as a garnish. Let's add that in. Oh, you can smell the freshness. It's just fantastic. Let the lights throw. Make sure to taste the hummus and add extra salt or pepper as you need. Mm. Tastes just wonderful. Now I'm going to add a tiny bit more olive oil, mix it in, and it's ready to serve. This really healthy and very creamy red kidney bean hummus is ready to eat. It's also ready to spread on my sandwiches for when I send the kids off to school. Protein packed and delicious. Thank you so much for joining me on Cravings Blog and see you next time. And please do visit my channel at youtube.com slash cravings Until the next time, see ya.